In a whimsical world by the winding river, there lived a charming and wise old goose named Mother Goose. Known far and wide for her magical rhymes and culinary talents, she had a special recipe to share. One sunny day, Mother Goose strolled along the riverbank, her feathers ruffled with excitement. She had found a parchment that held the secret to an enchanting recipe. Quack, quack, my dear little ones, gather round, Mother Goose calls out. I've discovered a delightful recipe, a tale of flavors and a magical spree. Hocus Pocus, listen well, my friends, no Hocus Pocus. Please and thank you, let them brew like magic. Wishes will come true, Mother Goose says with a twinkle in her voice. With quill and wing, she guides them through each step of the enchanting recipe. First, my dears, infuse the oil, Mother Goose instructs. Gently cook the garlic till it's gold, stirring softly, let magic unfold. Now in the bag, let's make a mix, a wondrous blend of olives and Havati tricks. With giggles and hops, they tossed in the herbs and cheese, imagining flavors swirling like spells in a cauldron. As the enchanted mixture chilled in the fridge, they prepared a grand feast. They toasted bread, laid out a feast of savory delights, and arranged the enchanted olive treats in pretty jars. Dear goslings, this recipe, a story so sweet, taught us patience, teamwork, and to be neat. With please and thank you, words so true, we've spun magic in all we do. Mother Goose says joyfully. With joyous honks, they indulged in the savory spread they'd created together, each bite a testament to their newfound culinary wizardry. As the sun set over the riverbank, Mother Goose tucked her goslings into their cozy nests. The recipe had become a cherished tale, a rhyming ode to magic, friendship, and delectable discoveries. And so, in the magical world by the winding river, the enchanting recipe of Mother Goose became a story whispered by the breeze, sung by the birds, and remembered in the hearts of all who listened.